Hello everyone, this is Amar Kumar Ram, welcome back to my channel. I know this is one of the most demanding playlists that is micro-fronted communication in multi -repo. Before proceeding further, there is a quick announcement like if you want to land on my channel, then you can search with the tag that is at the rate Amar-Kumar-Ram. Similarly, if you love to explore and travel the places, then you can check out our another channel that is with my wife. Neha, the channel name is Omar and Neha. So here you will find the detailed view of any place where we visit. More details will be provided in this channel video only. So to get the notification, you can subscribe this channel as well. Now let's start the development. To start with micro content communication video, we need to create two different projects, say host app and remote app. So let's quickly create those two projects. To create the projects, we'll run the command ng new host app with the configuration as routing enabled and style will be SCSS. So our host app project has been created and now we'll create the remote app. To create the remote app, we need to run command as ng new remote hyphen app with routing enabled and style as SCSS. As we can see, both the projects have been created like host app and remote app. And the difference between multi and monorepo workspace concept is in monorepo workspace, we have a common node modules folder. Whereas in this multi repo concept, we have two different node modules for two different projects. Even if we have multi projects, then we'll have multi node modules folder dedicated to that project only. Now we'll start the server for this individual app and see if everything installed properly or not. For that, We'll go inside the application. For example, we'll go first inside host app and we'll run the command ng s stands for server hyphen o which will open this project over the browser directly. Our host app is running fine over port 4200 and the message is displaying as host app app is running. Now we'll similarly run the remote app. Let's do that. To run the remote app, we need to open a new terminal. And we go inside remote app application and then run the command ng s stands for server hyphen. But 4200 port is already assigned to the host app. So it will ask that port 4200 is already in use. So would you like to use a different port? Of course, yes. And when we will implement the micro fronted architecture in this remote application and host application, then we will assign specific port to both the applications. For now, let's press Y and see the remote application over the browser or random port. So the random port that is assigned to the remote app is 49918 and our remote application is also working fine. The message is displaying as remote app app is run. Now in the next video, we'll add the micro fronted architecture inside these applications that is host app and remote app and then we'll proceed further. So let's meet in the next video. Till that, be happy. Take care. Signing off.